Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Thank you so much for stopping by, checking out another one of our videos. With us today, we have Sargent and we have Mishu. We're gonna be featuring a really short, low maintenance cut on Sargent today. We're gonna to save Mishu for another day. So let's get into this video. Okay, so we got Sargent on the table and what we're gonna do guys is we're gonna do a 7F blade all over on him. Real short cut, real tight, low maintenance. Nice summer cut. We're gonna start right here. And I'm just kind of supporting him here. I'm gonna go right down his back and just do a buzz down, just like that. Oh boy, Sergeant. You're such a good boy, buddy. I'm just gonna kind of blend down. Okay. I try not to come straight across like this because then you're gonna create like a line but a lot of these lines are just gonna go away with the finish. So I kinda just like to just go with the flow of hair is the key here. Come right down his leg. <laughs> you curious, buddy? Are you just curious? Are you a good boy, Sergeant? Are you a good boy, Sergeant? <laughs> you like the camera. Do you like the camera? Are you a good boy? Oh, Sergeant. You're so sweet, buddy. <laughs> okay, come on. <laughs> what a movie star. Mm -hmm. Good boy. You want to be really careful with the seven blade here and the hock area. You don't want to hit this. You'll cut them open if you do. So just really want to kind of keep that blade away from the skin using my uh, other hand on that. Just come right down his leg, right down his foot. Oh boy, Sergeant. And as we always mention, Sergeant is a little boy, so I got my hand up and I'm protecting his little penis there. What a good boy, Baba. And just going to do the same thing on this other side. Switch to left hand. It's just a summer cut, guys. People really like their dogs short in the summer months. Same thing here. Be real careful with the hawk area. It's okay, Bubba. 7F blade is very sharp, very pointy blade, so you really have to be careful with this blade. And this is just a prep. We're going to go over them later with the finish. So just blending off the top of his tail. Good boy, buddy. Oh, you good boy, Sergeant. Oh, the good boy, Sergeant. What are you doing? What are you doing? Hmm? You just happy? You're just so cute. <laughs> oh God, you're, you melt me, Sergeant. You are so cute. Okay, buddy. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> what are you, an owl? He's got like a lot of head motion, so I'm trying my best to kind of keep his head away from the clippers. And it's going to kind of start working down his front legs. Come behind the leg, the side of the leg, front of the leg. Just like that. Good boy, Sergeant. Okay, Baba. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy.
Oh boy. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy, buddy. I'm just working around him. He just really loves the camera, guys. He he wants you to see him, so I'm gonna let him let him do his thing. You go, boy. <laughs> do the same thing to this right front leg. Just want to be really careful with this seven blade. Don't go in the armpit with it. Again, just a very sharp blade that is very unforgiving, guys. So you just have to be very, very careful where you use this seven blade. It's more of just kind of surface clipping, um, you know, and uh, you don't want to do sensitive areas, the penis area, the butt area, or, you know, the armpits. Uh, you just don't want to use this seven blade. Seven blade is really just to give this short haircut, this body haircut. And we use our 10 blade, much safer blade for all of that other stuff. And another thing I want to tell you here is that right here, in this breastbone here, um, you, you, you don't want to dig too hard here because you're going to expose their skin. So kind of just doing like a little bit of a skim here. Um, and I don't want to buzz that too close because the way the breastbone is, you, you just kind of expose their skin. So more of like a blend off right in the front here. Just take it from the breastbone and then just start to ble uh, blend off and you can feel the breastbone it's right there and uh, see I may have already gone a little bit too short but kind of just blend off of that good boy I'm not doing his armpit here I'm just kind of doing his chest area so again careful with this seven blade And you want to be careful with the seven blade right in this neck area. Believe me, I've, I've nicked many a dog by doing that. And um, you just have to be very, very careful. All right. Nope. I'm trying to get as much off of his body as I could before I take him out of the noose. Because once they're out of the noose, you kind of have less control. So I'm doing as much as I can just to... Uh, get the, the body done. Good boy, Bubba. Good boy. Okay, so I'm going to take the noose off. And we're going to leave his ears really long and fluffy. Just kind of start in the back of the neck. And right down the back of his neck. Right to his back. Just like that. I'm going to do this. Again, we're just kind of staying with the flow of the hair. See how this hair is like that? So you just stay with the flow of the hair. You don't want to come up on it. It would take it way too short. Just holding his ear out of the way. Oh boy, Sergeant. And same thing on this side. See the flow of the hair going that way? So you want to kind of just shift and go that way. Oh boy, Bubba. Come on. Good boy. And like I said, this part here, you got to be super, super careful. So what I'm doing is I'm kind of angling the seven blade out a little. Rather than being real flush on the skin, kind of angling it out so that the 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 moving part of the blade 
is a little bit further away from the skin. I'm just gonna get his pads out of the way real quick. I forgot to do his pads. Sometimes I just go do the pads first, but um, we got right into the video, so I didn't do his pads. So I'm just gonna do a quick little pad clean up here. And you can see how much hair I'm getting off of this tiny little dog. It's okay, Sarge. Another one of those things you just you don't want to stay on it. You know, they tend to pull away on their feet. It's okay, Baba. He's still a pup. He's still getting used to it, guys. So, and he, he's an angel of a dog. So we just kind of want to make the grooming as stress-free as possible. Good boy, Sarge. You're such a good boy. Oh, baby. I'm just doing his pads with a 10 blade. Sometimes I'll do it with a 30, but I don't want to dig too hard with him just yet. He's not, I just got him used to really, you know, getting his pads done recently. And I don't want to dig too hard with a 30 and have him feel any sharp edge or anything. So the, the 10 is probably your safest blade you could use. Yeah. And uh, I'm sure you groomers out there, you just have a ton of 10 blades. I mean, this is probably just the most common blade that we use, this 10 blade, and uh, I've had this one a, a quite a long time, but um, you know, I sharpen my own blade, so uh, I got this, and I, I, I probably have at least 15 other 10 blades lying around, and I build blades, and but this 10 blade is just your utility blade, and you're gonna use this a lot, so. Yeah, you could see him kind of going back for himself. You know, when you first give them a haircut like that, they kind of feel a little weird, you know? So they tend to like, you know, go for their private parts and see what's going on. Yeah, good boy, Georgie. What a good boy, buddy. Yeah, give him a brief break. Good boy, buddy. I'm gonna spray my blade down. Oh, good boy, Sergeant. Okay, so, I'm gonna work on his face. Um, try to get some of the, oh, he's got some really, really big mats under his eyes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to loosen this up a little bit first with my finger and kind of get it away from his eye, maybe break it up a little bit, but you can see it's real, and, there, and it's very hard, so we may work this out in the tub. Um, see what I can get out here, though. Come here, Boston. Oh, boy, Sergeant. It's okay. If I have to dig too hard, I'll stop. You know, if I, if I feel like it's too much pulling, I'll just stop. Go, oh boy, Bob. Good boy. That's all right. Just gonna trim some of this ear hair out. It's okay, buddy. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. All right, you know what? Since I have his attention. I'm kind of just gonna take some of this face hair off anyway, because we're gonna take it off, and we'll get back to the eye. We'll um, again, we might be working that eye in the tub because it is pretty matted up. It's okay, Baba. Oh, good boy. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, Baba. It's okay, it's okay, Sergeant. Again, we're just working with Sergeant. He's, you know, he's a pup. Gonna pull away a lot. And, uh, just wanna be careful. Try your best, you know. You want to be careful in this neck area too, even with the 10 blade, because 10 blade will cut too. So kind of just tapping the chin. Don't dig in this area. Please don't dig in this area. You really want to finesse that area and go very slowly. And um, I sometimes use a snap-on comb there just to play it really, really safe. And I'll show you what I mean. It's okay, Sergeant. It's okay, Baba. 
lot of times they'll flinch because they just don't like the sound of the clipper when it's coming across their fur. But we're gonna even all this stuff out later. Good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, Sergeant. Good boy, Bubba. I'm holding his muzzle. I want to be real careful with his eye, you know, so I want to keep that blade away from the eye. Good boy, Sergeant. What a baby. The baby. All right, so we're going to take the focus off of that right now. And I'm going to spray my blade down again. Now this spray that I'm using, I'm using the Andis Cool Care, and what this, it's a five in one, so what it does is it cools off the blade and it disinfects it at the same time. So I, I really like uh, that spray. And what I'm doing now is I'm kind of, I'm doing this armpit here with the 10 blade again. 10 blade is the key blade there. You don't want to use a seven or you really don't want to use anything else. Sometimes what I'll do is I'll do this and kind of come from behind. Good boy, Sergeant. All right, checking my blade. It's nice and cool. Gonna do his little penis area here inside of his legs. Again, guys, we're just going over all this stuff later. So it doesn't have to be perfect right now. You want to be careful right here. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy, stay. Good boy. It's okay, Bubba. Good boy. Okay, Bubba. Give him a little rest. He got all that urine dried up on his penis. And we're going to clean that up and go over it later anyway. Oh boy. And we're going to clip all that hair in front of it so it just doesn't get all that urine doesn't get caked up over there, you know? Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. You're doing so good, Bubba. Oh, my buddy. Oh, my buddy. We just got to work out under those eyes, though. Poor baby. It's okay, Sergeant. Ugh. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna moisten that up in the tub because it's too hard. Okay, so just gonna go over his head. Oh yeah, I wanted to show you the snap-on comb thing here. So uh, let's see. I got a number four snap-on comb with a 30 blade. So what I'm gonna do is switch out these blades I'm putting my 30 on and a four snap on comb and you still have to be very very careful with this guys but what I do sometimes is again rather than use those those blades I'll come up with a with a four snap on comb just to be safe you know in that area and you still want to be careful because it's it's still very sharp it's very sharp plastic, and again, even if you're going at it like that, you can you can poke this little bit of skin here. That that neck skin is just you groomers know. I don't know if there's a groomer out there that hasn't <laughs> definitely nicked their dog in that area. And if you didn't, power to you. So you know what? Rather than go at his head with a seven blade right off the bat. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go at it with a five blade first. So again, they, they just want this dog short, um, but I'm gonna go slowly on it, you know? Take little bits of hair at a time, little sections. 
just to see what you're working with, you know? Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy, Bubba. It's okay, it's okay. Get that out of your head. It's okay, Bubba. Come on, come on. Good boy, good boy. And even sometimes, again, I love this little four snap on comb because it allows you to work a little safer over the eyes. It's not as hard as the blade. And uh, again, just a little bit more forgiving. It's okay, Bubba. Come here. Let me just get this. Oh, good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. It's okay, Sergeant. It's okay. There you go. There you go. There you go. Good boy. Come here. There you go, Sergeant. There you go, buddy. And as I mentioned with the breastbone, you can use the four blade out down there. It'll be a little, a little more discreet. Alrighty. So, good boy, Sergeant. What a good boy, Bubba. I am gonna try to get a little bit out with this 30. Stay, Bubba. If you're not experienced with doing this, guys, don't don't do it. Um, I feel confident that I can do it, so I got the one out. Stay, Bubba. If you can get it out before the tub, it's just better. It's okay, Bubba. Good boy. That's all, Sergeant. Now we can get the rest out in the tub. And... We're gonna leave it at that, guys. We're gonna get them in the tub and we're just gonna finish them up. Again, when the hair is cleaner, the blades are just gonna go right through them a lot quicker. Uh, before we do that, though, we're just gonna brush out his ears and his tail real quick. It's okay, Sergeant. Good job, good boy. And th th this little guy's like a year old, guys, so <laughs> give it up for him. He's such a trooper. He is such a trooper, such a loving dog. Come here, baby. And he lives with Mishu, and, and they're just so sweet together. And we're going to feature Mishu um, in, a, in a different video. We just figured we only had time for one today, so we picked Sergeant. You're a good boy, Sergeant. And the only other thing I have to do is I just have to clip his butt. Uh, with the 10 blade so real quick never up and down guys always side to side always side to side and and kind of downward um, if you're dealing with a female though or a dog that isn't neutered you have to be careful here okay uh, but sergeant's neutered so and, and he's a boy um, but if you were doing a girl right here you'd want to be really really careful because her vulva would be right there Nice clean butt area. Now we could scrub that a little easier and we don't have to pick at it. You clip it out this way, you, you don't have to pick at it in the tub and, and it comes out a lot cleaner. Oh, Sergeant. That's all, buddy. Okay, guys, so now Sergeant's just ready for the tub. We're gonna get him in the tub, give him a really good bath. Good boy, Sergeant. And we're gonna finish him up. You good boy, Sergeant. He's okay. Relax. I love you. I love you, Sergeant. Okay, so we got Sergeant out of the tub now. We gave him a nice blow dry, and we're just going to fine tune him and just go over what we did in the prep. And uh, we're just going to start off by using our, our seven blade and go right at him and just continue that haircut like we did before. Same thing, we're just going to go over it again. See, now, now that the hair is clean, the blade's gonna flow through that hair real easy. That's why you, you don't have to be too particular on your prep, because you're just gonna get a chance to even it all out. Good boy, Sergeant. 
Oh my body. Want to be real careful with the 7F in this area right here. We're going to edge that with the 10 blade later. Coming right down his legs. Oh, good boy, buddy. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. Gonna work his other side. Kind of see the difference already. See? And we're gonna edge that inside a little bit more with the 10 blade. But same thing, just gonna get a nice smooth finish on him. Good boy, buddy. Oh you good boy, Sergeant. It's it's a lot to expect from the dog, so we always talk about table time, and this is where kind of have to, um, you know, get it all in and get them off the table because after a while you're just going to lose their attention, so. All right, I'm just going to spray this blade down. It's getting a little warm. The one thing about these seven blades is that they, they don't get as hot as, say, like the ten blade. Um, so, but still, you have to check it anyway just to make sure but you can go a little bit longer with the seven blade, eight and a half. They're just kind of designed to, uh, you know, stay a little longer without getting hot, allowing you to work. There you go, Bubba. Oh. Stay, Bubba. Good boy. What a good dog, Sergeant. Okay, guys, just working our way up. Back up to his front legs here. So. Good boy. Oh, you good boy. You're such a good boy. Come here, Sergeant. His other front leg. You can see that blade just really flowing through that hair now. Down his feet. Oh boy. Oh, Sergeant. It's okay, buddy. Come on. Hold him on here. Okay, go ahead and put your foot down. Good boy, buddy. So this is definitely the type of haircut that's just going to last a while. You're not going to have to worry about him. You're not going to worry about brushing him too much because he's so short. Just a real easy easy haircut to maintain and just not have to worry about. Good boy, Sergeant. And he's just amazingly good for such a young dog. What's the matter, Sergeant? Come here, come on. Good boy. Good boy, come here. Okay, so let's be careful with the breastbone. I'm gonna kinda just trim around it. We're actually gonna use a snap-on comb for that. Oh good boy. Oh good boy. 
Here's such a little boy, buddy. Oh, Sergeant. Come here, I'll put you back in the noose. Okay, so now we're gonna work his face a little bit, guys. You can see how uneven it is. Again, with the prep, uh, you know, we just decided to get him off the table and get him in the tub, but now we're gonna, we're gonna even that all out. So we're back onto our 10 blade here. It's okay, Bubba. Come here. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. Good boy. Oh, good boy. What a good dog. Come on. Good boy. Come on. Come on. It's okay. It's okay. Good boy. Oh, good boy. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. All right, so he's getting a little antsy on his face. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna we're gonna leave it alone for now, um, and we're gonna kind of do some edging with our ten blade. So we're gonna leave it alone for now. We're gonna come back to it in a little bit. Uh, again, we don't want to stay on one thing too long. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm going to start to edge. So you see all this wispy stuff here. So we're gonna just take our ten blade and just go over it like this. Oh boy, Sergeant. Just gonna edge everything inside of the leg, come right down it with our 10 blade like that. Come this way, come right down it. There you go, buddy. Good boy, good boy. Good boy, buddy. Good boy, Sergeant. Good boy. Come here. Come here, Papa. Oh, good boy. What a good boy. All right. All right. When you do that, then you you know come back to the face a little bit, get a couple of more swipes in, you know. Good boy, Sarge. You're so sweet. Oh, good boy. Come on. Almost done, Bubba. Oh, good boy. There you go, Sergeant. See? Good boy. Okay, here. We're going to switch out to the four snap on comb again. And we're just kind of going to kind of blend off that chest bone area. Take that down. We're just going to scissor that up later, too. Good boy, Sergeant. Okay. Just really working his head here. Good boy, buddy. Oh, you're looking so cute there. You're looking so cute, Sergeant. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Yep, so we're just working his head, guys. We're gonna start a, a little scissoring soon. Uh, just kind of going over his head. Blend down his legs a little more. Good boy, Sergeant. You look into the camera. Look into the camera. Hey. Good boy, Papa. All right, guys. 
they like nice long ears. But we're just going to cut a little bit off the end like this. That's it. Good boy, Sergeant. You have such beautiful ears. Look at your ears. You are so handsome. So handsome, buddy. I love your ears, Sergeant. Mm, Peppa. Let me see how you look. Oh, you handsome boy. You handsome boy. Look at you. You're so cute. So cute, buddy. Oh, you good boy. I'll just kind of hit this corner here a little bit like that. A little bit right here. Create a little edge there. You good boy. Good boy, Sergeant. Look at you. So handsome. Get your hair cut. Look at you. <laughs> Good boy. Scissor up the feet a little. When I do the feet, I try not to expose the nail too much. Sometimes, you know, if you cut too much off the top of the foot, the nail gets exposed. It kind of looks a little funny. It's nice if it's just hair. Go by, Sarge. And you're just grabbing all these little wispy hairs. Boy, buddy. See, like if I cut this top hair, that nail's going to get exposed. So kind of just trim a little bit of it so you're not completely exposing the nail. It's okay, Sergeant. He's getting a little tired, guys, so I just really have to sum up this grooming for him. Come here, Papa. He's okay. Come here. Good boy. You good boy? Hmm? It's a handsome boy. So cute. Give it up for Mishu and Sergeant, two adorable little puppies. We did the same thing on Mishu that we did on Sergeant. We basically just Gave him a 7F all over, short cut, left the ears and tail long, really easy cut to maintain, good summer clip. Guys, if you like this video, do us a favor, smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. Thank you so much. <laughs> good boy. Good boy. I love you. I love you. I love you guys. Yes. You're so cute. You're just so cute. Too much love. Watch me.